In question 17 we're told that P is directly proportional to Q cubed. And we're asked to find a formula for P in terms of Q. So we know that P is proportional to Q cubed, but we need to know um, to what ratio. So we introduce this variable K, Q cubed, and then we substitute in the values they've given us. So therefore, 270, let me just do that again. 270 equals k 7.5 cubed and therefore k <coughs> equals 270 over 7.5 cubed which is 0 0.64 so therefore the formula will be p equals 0 0.64 Six four Q cubed. In part B, we're asked to work out the positive value of Q when P equals Q. <coughs> so using that same equation, P equals 0.64 Q cubed. We're told that P equals Q, so therefore Q equals 0.64 Q cubed. If we rearrange this equation then, so we have to get q's onto one side, everything else onto the other side, the way that we would do this is we would divide throughout by q, and that would cancel with that to give us 1, this would cancel with that to give us q squared. So we'd end up with q squared equals 1 over 0.64 so that means that q equals the square root of 1 over 0.64 <coughs> and the square root of the square root of 1 over 0.64 gives us 1.25